So you decided to sell your house. Well, one of the major questions that a lot of people ask themselves is, should I use a realtor or should I not? We're about to find out. Hi, I'm Derek Jackson with The Jackson Group. And on this video, we're gonna go over what a realtor's role is in selling a home so you can determine if it's worth it or not. So the first role I play is educator and consultant. So part of what I do is to help people learn about all their options to see if selling the house right now is for you or it's not. Obviously it's your house, not mine. You're the boss. So part of my role is to help you to understand where the market's at, what homes are going for in your area, and also getting an accurate appraisal number on your property. The second role I play is to help become almost a designer of sorts. So I help go through the property with you to be able to help possibly declutter or position the home in such a way to where it's showcased in its best possible light for the buyers that are going to be looking through the home. Buying a home is an emotional process. So I have to be able to help bring emotion to the property so that buyers can connect to it. And this is some of the things that help them to be able to feel comfortable to submit an offer on your home. The third role I have is a marketing expert. So I have to be able to position your home and market it in front of buyers wherever they're searching at to make sure the right people can see that your house is for sale and know to come see it. Now, marketing today is totally different than marketing 30, 40 years ago, because now we have to understand what the online environment is like and how each site plus social media interact with each other so that there's a flow people get excited and go from one spot to the next to come seeing your home via an appointment. Now that your house is online and marketed the right way and people are excited, I have to make sure all of the concrete details are spelled out correctly so that when the emotional experience happens, now they can get the right information that allows them to be able to submit an offer on your property, like school district, zoning, all those sorts of important details that people are going to also consider when buying a home. And that's why my fourth role is to be a tour guide because I don't want people just to like the house, I want them to love the house and fall in love with the house. That's why it's important for me to know everything that's going around the property in the surrounding community because that way those are the sorts of things that help people to fall in love with the property and make that decision to actually put a pen to paper and put an offer on your property. Once my marketing plan is in place, I know I'm gonna get you an offer. And when that offer does come in, this is when I have to become a tough negotiator to make sure that we keep money in your pocket and get you the best price possible so you're selling for top dollar. I've been doing this since 07. I've accumulated a lot of experience over time and this experience comes into play, especially during the negotiation phase, because that can mean the difference between leaving thousands of dollars on the table for the buyer or those thousands of dollars going in your pocket and staying in your pocket. Once we get the property under contract, it's at this point that I become a therapist because believe it or not, no disrespect, but you're gonna need it. There are gonna be a lot of bumps in the road. I have a team in place that helps make sure that all those bumps get smoothed out and we continue to progress towards a successful and smooth closing. So I also become like a fireman. Whenever a fire pops up, because it will pop up, I'm always there with my hose to put it out and make sure that we get to a closing for you. So I hope this video helps to outline and maybe clarify all the roles that I, as a real estate broker, play. Being a real estate broker is more than just opening a door, signing a contract, and then collecting a check. There's a lot of moving parts there's a lot of balls in the air at the same time that we have to facilitate and help make sure that no balls drop to make sure your life is easy and you get to a closing table. My name is Derek Jackson with The Jackson Group. Click somewhere around this video. Feel free to reach out via phone or email. I love to answer questions and would love to talk about any questions you do have or about your specific situation or specific unique property. 